Hello guys, my name is Serenity and welcome back to my Sims 3 Let's Play Hope Story and this is video number 3. Last time we left off, Hope went to bed at like 4pm and she woke up and decided she wanted to get rid of all of the laundry that was laying around because it was grossing her out. I also took it upon myself to redecorate a little bit and she's going to bed because she's tired. Um, I fixed the bathroom on the basement level and I upgraded the washer and dryer because I did sell the car and I'm going to, and because it's so high, I'm, my house funds are so high, I'm definitely not going to apply for funds at the, um, the academic building, but I fixed up downstairs as well. I took away the little, um, carpets, but I have, I put two treadmills right here. I bought this so they can practice their little moves and I just fix it up a little bit. Up here, I put up new curtains, repainted the, um, the walls with new wallpaper. I purchased this and in the kitchen, upgraded the fridge, got a dishwasher because we desperately needed that. Oh goodness, what's going on? It's raining. All right. And in here, I mean, I didn't do too much different. I got a, I'm going to stop this with goldfish. She doing she wake up. Jellyfish. Oh. Minnows. Okay, and goldfish. Okay. So when she wakes up, she's going to stop that. But yeah, I fixed this up. The living room. I upgraded. Got a new TV stand. Some new flowers. New couches. Lighting. I even gave them a bar since they like to throw parties. I mean, it's only fitting that they have a bar, right? So I did that. What is going on? Okay, anyway. So up on this level, let me turn on this light. This light. And it's a sucky light. You need better lights right here. Those lights suck. Okay, so hold on. Let me... Do they have any? No. Okay, this is a sorority house, so why not make it a little bit fancy? Stop trying to make me buy stuff. No. Um, so. And those lights still suck. I'm going to have to put some lamps or floor lamps in here. But I put new furniture here. New coffee table just to make it look better. Wasn't a big difference. What I'm going to do next just to get rid of some of the Samoans, extra Samoans I have, is I am going to upgrade their beds, which I'm going to do now. I'm going to do that now. Now that I'm thinking about it. So I'm going to upgrade their beds. That's so creepy. Um, I guess the most expensive twin I can get is... Well, we're definitely not getting that. That's just so out of place. This one. Oh no, can't do that one. Okay, this one. So we're gonna upgrade 
Care beds. Okay, let me just do that because I forgot. You have to diversify this a bit. So how about this? Give her that one. And that one, just to make it more diverse. I'm also, while I'm in here, I'm just gonna upgrade all of their beds. And this is a single room one, but I'm gonna upgrade this bed, that's fine. And she's already sleeping hers, right? I'm gonna upgrade, upgrade her bed, and then I'll do the other Sims bed when she is not sleeping in it. Okay. So yeah, and eventually i'm going to maybe upgrade their desk or maybe i'm not i don't know but yeah so that's pretty much what i did it wasn't like anything too fancy and i do notice it's raining a lot but it's still 12 days before fall is there a guy here oh is that scott hello scott Let's go say hi. Still some of Harris's shine. Unless he's about to leave. Let's have her call him over. Or is he going in the house? Is he her boyfriend maybe? Oh, and I did buy this grill so we can stop making hot dogs. In the microwave. And of course there's this hot tub. But it's been raining since it was purchased. So... And of course, we also have this here. And I we didn't to call it kickball. I forgot a hanky sack or something, and a football to play too. Since a lot of <laughs> yeah, so we got this cool fish tank. I mean, I would like to upgrade the counters too. And I think maybe all four. Was well, until she graduates, she will be staying here. However, I do know each time she comes back, um, she'll have new roommates. But as long as she, you know, keeps in contact with the ones that matter the most, that's all. So we're going to just say hi to Scott. You never know what he is. Sometimes he's a teacher, sometimes he's a student. Uh oh. The room isn't finished. Uncovered walls or floors. Where? Oh, I don't see. Oh, goodness. Uh oh. They don't like each other? She don't like his brother. I don't see where it is. Okay, I'm not going to worry about that right now. I'll fix it. But um, let me have her go to bed. Like, really go to bed this time. I just wanted her to... Because a lot of these sims, like I said, after she leaves and comes back, she be, she'll be here two, for two weeks, sim weeks. And... Oh. Rude guest. What did he do? Is some is his brother here? Is <laughs> her face is like what? What is this? Why is he here? <laughs> what does he want? I thought she was going to bed. Did I? 
I am about to make her go go to bed. I wonder if it's because I didn't do the entire floor this color. Maybe that's why? Because I definitely did not, like, do anything to the structure of the house. I hate that moodlet. So I'm not going to... See, uncovered floors, walls, or floors. It's probably the floor. Because both of these floors were the same originally, and I made that different. Oh, I forgot I did, um, <laughs> okay, I'm going to make her go to bed, like, really, really, she really does need to go to bed, she needs to study, too, oops, nope, it's too early, I didn't mean to click on that. And of course she has, oh no, she's sick. There is no hospital here. I I probably should have edited the world and put a hospital here because of this when they get sick. Cause now she's gonna be sick for two days, which sucks. When, if there was a hospital here and I will definitely put that on my list of things to put in this world, but Right now, she has a, she wants to be a rebel. She wants to gain enough influence to join the social group. So that is definitely something we're going to work on. Yeah, Scott, goodbye. You were only here until like almost four in the morning. What was she telling a ghost story to? She is weird, yo. But there was no one here. Really? Well, she's in the kitchen cleaning up. She's our little cleaner. Cade or Katie? 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 I'll call her Katie. <laughs> she always cleans up. We count on her. And if she always cleans, I'm going to get to know her. I bet you she's a perfectionist or she's neat. She can become a friend to her. Her and Paris. But yeah. Um, she is hungry, but I'm not going to have her do that first. I'm going to have her and use the bathroom, take a shower. Let's have her brush her teeth and also gussy up. Then she's gonna go downstairs. I'm sure there's still, how much time does she have? She only has three hours, so we're gonna just eat leftovers. Since she does not have a lot of time, but I do want her to cook more to work on her cooking. And maybe she'll take a, a class to, you know, upgrade her cooking and stuff like that. And also, she was not, did she work on her writing? I can't remember. But I may have her, I feel like being a college student and aspiring to write your first novel, I mean... It could work, but it couldn't work. We'll save that for after she graduates, but I definitely want her to work on refining her writing skills. So when she does start to write, why is my phone going off? And when she does start to write a novel, you know, her skills will be pretty high and she'll have more options.
sorry i just wanted to silence my phone sometimes i forget to do that until it goes off well she cannot eat right now so i'll have her i know you're hungry hope we'll stop at one of the shops and have her but when she goes to class i'm gonna have her work hard because we have to get her performance up. Her performance is still pretty low. And yay, because the cars are gone, she's now riding her bike, which I like much better. Get to enjoy the scenery and stuff too. Instead of it zooming by in that freaking car. Who is that slurping on stuff? Is he a student? <laughs> really? Well, a lot of the Sims here, too, when you get to know, like, some of the local ones that come with the expansion, a lot of them have multiple degrees. So, yes, I shouldn't be surprised he's here as an old man. So, I'm going to fast forward this, this, and... have her work hard and then I'm going to have her go to lunch at the bistro hopefully there's a friend nearby she can go to lunch with to build a friendship with um well to build that relationship and then I will have her because when I was fixing everything up I also I was able to find an umbrella and we have street art so they're gonna have her um acting out and doing some graffiti hopefully she doesn't get caught and get arrested but to build her rebel influence she wants to sing karaoke i don't even think it's a place around oh it is a place oh hold on take it easy oh it's too late shall we finish i know you're hungry okay so I'm gonna have her go to this bistro. I'm gonna have her eat. She has no one around her she can eat with. No, don't go home. Don't go home. Um, I don't want her to go home. Let's have her say hi to someone. Oh, what was this? Let's have her do a friendly introduction. To Jared Piper. I do want her to make friends, and too bad he doesn't belong to a social group. There's no one else around here, though. Hold on, are they involved? Whoa, she's attracted to him? Okay, and I'm big on this too with Sims. Like, if my Sim is oh, Shannon is close. Okay, let's have her go eating with her roommate. But if I base my Sim having a relationship with other Sims based on if she's attracted to them or not. Oh, I forgot, it's a fancy bistro place, so that's her formal wear. It's cute, isn't it? It kind of, the way I have it, it does look like it's blue jean or whatever, but, well, no, it doesn't. It looks, it's cute, period. It's really cute. So, she's going to go. It's so funny because she is so, well, she doesn't sound masculine like that other 
sim. <laughs> but yeah, she's gonna go to lunch with her um sorority sister. Uh, I love those um songs that you sing when you're becoming a singer. I love those songs. So yeah, they are going to the bistro. And since they're going to have lunch inside, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward it. Okay, a busboy tripped and knocked the entire cart of desserts all over you. Do you want to yell at him or be kind? Be kind. He tripped. He didn't do it on purpose. Certain items in your inventory will go to... Oh, what's over there? Okay, he apologized and assured you that... Assured her that her meal would be on them. She's giving a... Okay, hold on. Complimentary group serving of the finest baked angel food cake. Okay. When she gets um, home, she can put that on like the table and stuff. No. For some reason, she doesn't like him. It's like when she spoke to Scott, there was like... She just didn't like him. I don't know why. Okay, so now let's have her go over here. I'm sure she won't get caught right here, right? It's in back of the comic book store. But, like right here, let's have her start. In her dress. <laughs> she is so bad, eh, yo. I feel like as long as no one sees her, she should be fine. Our time is I think it makes her look even cooler that she's willing to do it in her formal wear. That's that's cute. <laughs> Good girl with a rebellious streak. That's what she is. You know, she's a good girl on the outside. Of, she wants to be a, a professional author, but on the inside, she just wants to rebel a little bit. Okay. I think that looks really cool. Alright, cool. So let's have her go here and do this one. As long as the police are not around, or there's not someone around who would catch her. I just want to take pictures of that. <laughs> That's cute. I I got color for what it is. Urban work of art. I'm some spray paint and a healthy dose of moxie. Hope beautified her neighborhood <laughs> with some street art. She wants to complete three wall murals, but first, let's call Lizzie, since she really wants to do that. She can't, because Lizzie must be really close by, so she can't call her. So 
So I'll have her text her. And now, with that done, um, we're going to go... And I'm going to have her take a street art class just to up her skill. And when she's further away, then I'll have her call Lizzie just to satisfy that want. I'm going to have her change too. Now, for quite some time, because I got tired of using this world, I was using a custom university world by my sim reality, and I liked it a lot, but I found myself missing the original university world, which was this one. And so... I had to uninstall it, but I still have it. I think it's called Simiopolis, and it's by My Sim Reality, and it's a really good world. It has a lot. It has apartments and stuff too, but I found myself missing the simplicity of this world, so I uninstalled it, but I definitely want to do <clears throat> a Let's Play with a different um, character, and... <laughs> Yeah, uh, maybe we should count his friend. Look at his rank. He's rank nine. Yeah. Oh, it's getting really dark. No lights. Okay, there they go. So she took her street art class. Let's have her. Call Lizzie to fulfill that want. And once she calls Lizzie, then we then we will um make this a um wish. Just having a long talk with Lizzie, so I'm gonna... She's tired, so now she's going to head on home. We're back to her sorority. Her sorority house. I love that up there. That's really cool. Oh, and I forgot, I did put a little fountain out front as well. So she's extremely tired, so I'm going to just have her go to bed because... That just makes the most sense. I mean, it's 9.32 p.m., so it's pretty late. She had a full day with her classes, going out to lunch with her um, sorority sister, and then 
engaging in some street art activity so she definitely had a busy day and also at least she was able to talk to someone she likes it seems like she does like Lizzie a lot so that's cool too one of the things I do want to do before fall comes because the closer it gets to fall starts to rain more and then you know so I kind of want her to but it's not even a weekend yet it's only Wednesday so we definitely still have time a good week and a half to do some fun stuff I guess her hamper has become really full, so now that's why I have that move it. But So she's already done two murals and she wants to complete three. So we are definitely going to work on um, her completing a third one. So let me wake her up. Have her use. Uh, blush it. Use it. Shower. Why is she laughing? Have her brush her teeth. Hopefully. Hopefully, um, she has a little bit of time. Or maybe if she'll just eat a leftover again. <laughs> and she did meet somebody she actually was attracted to so we're definitely going to keep up with him and have her become good friends with him and see where that goes as well and since she has so many so much funds I am going to go ahead and hire a maid services to clean up this house every day. I don't want a butler here because for one, we don't have the room. For two, they, their meals are like always perfect and I kind of want her to like cook more. If you have a butler making a like, perfect hill. <laughs> As you eat with flies in your face. Well, she is too. Hope is too. Normal people wouldn't eat with flies. Flying around her face like that. Yeah, off camera, I'll fix the flooring. I guess I can make them the same color, I guess. Yeah, I guess I could. Alright, so we're gonna hire a maid. The problem with maids is that sometimes they don't do their freaking job. Oh, oh, that sucks. I totally forgot to have her sit that out. Now it's spoiled. Look at that perfectly good angel food cake. 
That sucks. It's not in there anymore, so she shouldn't have that mood light anymore. Oh, does she have a lecture today? Looks like she has lecture today. Chandra. That's so bonnish. Boosh. Is Skip a fairy? He was not a fairy when I originally saw him. I don't recall him being a fairy. That's the only thing I always hated. The clutter and they're all just waiting to get in. She's missing her lecture. Get in there. Hurry up. Have her take notes. Ask questions. Who is snoring? Oh, him. Oh, she is a rebel. Let's make friends with her. Class ends at 10. So, once class ends, are there any other rebels in here? Ooh, another one. Oh, a lot of them. Oh, yeah. So she's about to introduce herself to all of them. Friendly introduction. Look at you, Muggsy. How did you become a vampire? But then again, Skip is a fairy. They don't like each other. Oh, she's my roommate. Let's just do an introduction. She's in a group? No, you are not going home. I'm gonna have her introduce herself. Her. Okay, come on. Well, that's her roommate, so she can do that. So hopefully she can introduce herself to her at least. Are there roommates too? Oh, cool. 
So she earned enough influence to join the rebels, the rebel influence. So that's so she's going to work on increasing her title. Writers tend to be pretty artsy. It's a tell funny story. I guess she can make friends with Sid as well, since he's a rebel. She is in a group with who? Who is she in a group with? Or was it that there were so many rebels around, people in the, that they just became a group? She's attracted to Sid. I'm even starting to question her taste, seriously. But then again, he's cool and like, the skateboarder hippie type of way. See, he graduated from Sims before with a degree in science and medicine. So now that she's done with that, um, because, you know, she wants to, you know, while she, you know, has the inkling to be rebellious, she really wants to build up her networking and stuff. So we're going to have her take a Valentine budget class. Okay, yes. And I'll have her take a attend, I have her attend a resume writing and interview techniques class. Because she is, and I definitely want to um, clarify that, one of her traits is ambitious so when you're an ambitious sim you do everything possible to make sure you succeed i think they're definitely together or they're really good friends i have to watch them oh hello kyle yeah we're gonna introduce ourselves to kyle as well let's go here I turned down, hold on, I turned down the volume for just music. And it's mostly just the stereo because it plays like, but I want to hear. So it's just mostly when we go into restaurants and diner, diners and we hear the pop music, which is based on real life pop music, which could get you a copyright strike or whatever so ah oh, fiddling with spreadsheets upset hope the mont's bank account and she managed to lose 72 simoleons well she tried and i do want to note too that i have the lifespans set really long because i like to really take my time and play with, with my sims so i intend for this to be a very long Let's play and let's hope accidentally dies or something. <laughs> you never know. So, yeah, once she gets done taking his resume writing and interview techniques, she's going to come over here. Hopefully Kyle is still here. Just her luck, he'll be gone.
Is she still in the group? And we're gonna look for another place to do that third mural as well. So, taking that resume writing interview techniques class made Hope Their Mind a better writer and more charismatic. Okay, that's definitely a plus. So she is going to introduce herself. Oh, she's still sick. Well, she won't be sick for too much longer. Paparazzi, who's a celebrity over here? No one's a celebrity, so why is the paparazzi here? Oh, him? Tell a funny story. Ask about major. Why can't she be attracted to someone like Kyle or something? But then again, he's. Hopefully she actually cleaned up. Kyle also has a good sense of humor as well. So they have a trade in common. I'm going to ask about his alma mater. And they're going to talk about art. <laughs> so after she speaks to Kyle, I'm going to have her, she's going to say goodbye to him and then she's going to go home. Yeah, so she's gonna go back to her back home. And I don't want her to go to sleep just yet, but because she took that resume writing class, she was able to work on her writing skills. So we got a little, at least a little bit of time in to do our writing skills, which is cool. But I also want her to cook dinner because I really want her to work on her, this, oh goodness. Yeah, I want her to work on her um, cooking skills as well. Cool. They're out there playing football. Who's that? She's a witch? So in this instance, where's the other one at? 
There we go. Okay, I'm gonna have her serve dinner. See, we gotta learn how to make more than just autumn salad, mac and cheese, and so forth. Okay, but it looks like the maid cleaned up. I swear I never noticed her until recently. And I sure didn't notice that we had a fairy in the house. No, I'm no not put away. I want her to eat. I want her to grab her pig eat before she goes to bed. So we have a witch and a fairy in the house. She's actually really cute. We'll become her friend. She doesn't get along with anybody. You little ugh. Let's do a friendly introduction. Alright, well, that's my fault. I, there we go. Oh. What's going on here? Okay, I just want to introduce myself to Waverly. And, hello, Paris. She was like, I'm just rolling in. So let's try this again. Friendly introduction. Okay, I'm gonna have her go to bed. Sleep. Looks like she wants to hire a butler. Oh, I guess Waverly is not in. Okay, she was just visiting. Okay. Okay, well... I am going to end this let's play here. We had an eventful um, few days with Hope. She was able to gain enough influence or now she is a part of the rebel social group. Now she has to keep earning influence to increase um, her title. So, and we still have to find another place to make her mural. So, mural. So that's what we're gonna work on that. And we're also gonna get this wish fulfilled, learning a painting skill. And I guess it's easier to do that more on the weekend since, you know, it's not as high on a priority list. So thank you all for watching. Thank you to those who are watching in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you.